Hey guys, so I just wanted to come on this morning and give a quick word for the day. Um, I hope my lighting is good because it's currently 6.15 in the morning and I am outside of the gym getting ready to go get a quick little workout in. Um, I wanted to come on and just give a quick word of encouragement because I know it's the beginning of the year and a lot of believers are, you know, fasting and praying, possibly doing your Daniel fast or whatever kind of fast. Or even if, it, if you're not fasting because it's the beginning of the year and you're just fasting because you have a lifestyle of fasting. I just wanted to share this word of encouragement. So this morning as I was reading Daniel chapter 10, um, it was explaining how Daniel had this vision and... Um, obviously the vision you know concerned him he was a little i guess he was he he was frightened i should say a little bit so he understood particularly he understood a little bit of the vision and that it meant hardships and wars for times to come so because of this vision that daniel had daniel was in mourning and he fasted for 21 days so it tells that um what else happened Hold on, guys. Let me get it together. And guess I'm not even going to edit this. Like, it's just going to be what it's going to be. So, um, yeah, so he fasted and he mourned for 21 days. And at the end of the 21 days, the angel of the Lord appeared before him. And, you know, he appeared before him in a vision. Like, you got to read on to chapter, um, read Daniel chapter 10, 11, and 12. Because it ends at 12 and it just, like, the angel of the Lord just going over uh, just everything pertaining to what his vision meant at the times to come or whatever. But the encouraging thing was to know that Daniel fasted for 21 days, right? It didn't say that, you know, after the fifth day, he got his answer. After the 10th day, he got his answer. Even after the first day, he got his answer. He didn't get his answer to the 21st day. And the angel of the Lord has said, since you saw you know since you sought god <clears throat> for understanding your answer was available the first day so the first day that daniel sought to fast and seek the lord his answer came that first day but because um uh the war that was going on in the spiritual realm with the prince of persia don't quote me but it was a prince somewhere over there um the answer was delayed because the angel the lord had to fight against this principality as well as you know he had to wait for backup to come from michael the archangel so i just wanted to come on here and just give a word of encouragement that if you're fasting to keep on fasting to keep on praying don't give up even if you don't see the answer after a day or two or even immediately just know that your answer is coming in jesus name and to continue and also when you get a dream it goes to show that daniel had this dream right or daniel had this vision and the first thing he did was he sought God for understanding. So if you don't have understanding pertaining to your dreams or interpretation interpretation of your dreams, it means that maybe you need to seek the Lord. Stop going to other people and asking them, what does this dream mean or what does this vision mean? Perhaps you need to go to God who is the one who gives dreams, who can give you the interpretation of that dream. So, yeah, that was the quick message for the day. All right, guys, be blessed.